Four restaurants across North Carolina issued their last calls. The statewide alcohol curfew officially started at 11 o'clock tonight, and you can still buy alcohol at the store if it's open that late. Mecklenburg County has already been under a similar order, but a local bar told us this week they decided to defy the order with safety in mind. We spoke to the CEO of Penn's Mechanical earlier this week, who told us they would reopen and they did. The popular spot reopened for one night, but that changed tonight. Our Hunter Signs is live outside Penn's Mechanical. Hunter, what happened? Hey there, Fred. Penn's Mechanical was supposed to be open tonight. Patrons were supposed to be inside drinking, having a good time from a distance, of course, but that is not the case. They are closed again. You can see this closed sign standing outside of the building here tonight. It was put up just after the county health director told CMPD to enforce the governor's order. Group after group turned away by a closed sign outside Penn's Mechanical Company in South End. So I scooted all the way here. I was planning to meet some friends and go to Penn's, but we just found out we were, they were closed. So The popular bar and game business opened Thursday, defying the governor's order for places like this to be closed. And so after being closed for four months, at some point, I still need to run a business. We spoke with the owner as they opened. We have the space. We have the ability to social distance. We're very confident that it's a safe, open environment. But on Friday, Mecklenburg County Health Director Gibby Harris told us Pins is not a restaurant. They have no permit to operate as one. I have talked with Deputy Chief Estes, and he will have an officer go back out and enforce the executive order, which does not allow bars or arcades at this time. We didn't know. We were ready to meet our friends. <laughs> Some South End patrons were surprised at the quick action, but thankful as well. We don't know the rules. Like, I mean, I feel like since they're a business, they should know whether or not they should be open. So since they weren't following it, like, that sucks. <laughs> the bar had invested in high-tech sanitizing. There was to be no standing at the bar, no shared games, and no duck pin bowling. But for the county, they were still defying an order. And we never did see CMPD officers show up here at Penn's Mechanical. This place just closed this afternoon. The staff, though, tells me it is a sad situation because 130 employees now have no jobs yet again. Live in South End tonight, Hunter Signs, WCNC Charlotte. Yeah, that's the reality with this virus. Thank you, Hunter, for that report.